I just wanted to make this video for a couple of reasons. Firstly, I wanted to thank you all so much for tuning into the major. Um, I also secondly want to talk about this year of evolution that has been for me. Um, since I found out at SI 2020 that I was being offered a position, you know, with EUL and APAC North and obviously all these other events, I said to myself, you know, I, I and at the time I considered myself an analyst. I, I'd never really thought that I, I'd go down the road as a caster or, or I'd be doing mostly analysts with a little bit of casting here and there. And as the months sort of got on, um, I practiced a lot of casting anyway, because I knew that we would be doing a lot of these swapping around from the desk to the cast, etc. And I've gotten to the point where we got to the EU major and I was told I'd be casting the finals alongside my very capable play-by-play -play duo, Des, who has been an absolute amazing duo to work with. And it's it's been a journey for me because... Casting isn't particularly a role I've ever trained for. Um, I'm, I'm, as you know, I'm mostly an analyst. And my heart has been ever so full with everyone who has complimented me on my casting, given me feedback to help me grow has been the most important. Um, all of the support that I've gotten from my colleagues, from production, Ubisoft for entrusting me to cast the finals alongside Des. The, the explosion of what I feel I've been able to achieve since... February and the growth from SI 2020 and what I produced there to what I feel I can produce now and I'm able to to give the world and help give justice to some of these games has been phenomenal and I just really want to thank you all for being there throughout my own journey um, it's been an absolute honor to be part of the journey of all of these teams to be part of the evolution and journey of the new format of competitive siege um, there's so much that I feel so privileged to be part of and on a personal level, I've felt so incredibly pressured to provide, um, uh, you know, high level kicks and intero level version of casting, um, you know, Zeronic level desk analyst um, or analysis rather. And, and it's been quite a lot that I've thought about over all of these months, you know, back when stage one started and then, you know, obviously into stage two and beyond and I think I've never stopped and and said to myself, hey, you did a pretty good job and, and you've been improving bit by bit. And I think today after casting the finals and, and being given that privilege, I do seriously want to thank everyone who's believed in me. This role was something I didn't expect myself to be in, as I said, and I'm putting my absolute all into it. And I appreciate every single one of you who, who have supported me. Like I said, the feedback to help me get better the duos that I've had along the way, the the observers who who are able to listen to what I'm saying, change what we're seeing on the screen to help better tell my story that I'm trying to get over. I mean, it's been a, a roller coaster ride for me. I am so proud to be part of this and I am so thankful that people believed in me going into this, still believe in me. And um, yeah, I guess I'm just overwhelmed with emotions that I've been able to achieve what I have and I hope to keep achieving so thank you guys so much and um yeah we've still got the NA major coming up we've still got the APAC major oceanic as well and and yeah I will keep giving it my all because this game deserves that it deserves to be given as much justice as much elevation as it can and I've loved the competitive scene for years in many different forms and I've been involved in many different ways so thank you for giving me this platform and giving me the stage and thank you to everyone who's worked with me and around me let's keep smashing it guys